You got some bad actors out there that are deliberately using this to cover up their identity. No miss mask. If people need for safety, let it be for safety. Like it or not, Nassau County Republicans led by legislator Mozzie Pillip are moving ahead with a plan to ban masks in public, a far cry from the mask up mandates of the pandemic. The purpose of this bill really to prevent those people to hide behind the mask and terrorize the Jewish community. Pillip says the move comes following too much masked bad behavior around the recent pro-Palestinian protest. She and other Republicans also say robbers are commonly masking up before barging into stores. Masks used to be illegal at protests due to some of the same concerns, but that law was lifted for COVID. The main thing is how it's going to be enforced. We can't have a situation that we're giving permission for people that are wearing masks for health reasons to be questioned and felt threatened. Delia Dirigi Witten, Democratic Nassau County Minority Leader, says she's not entirely opposed to the legislation, but does not believe her Republican colleagues have thought out how this would go down. We have no information with this law. It's very vague once again. So let's see if they've even thought it out. Like who's going to enforce it? Who's going to, you know, what's going to happen if someone walks up to someone and, and starts questioning them and that person, you know, it, it could cause major issues, major lawsuits. But Republicans say this is just a common sense proposal and police can figure it out. If you see a, 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 a little old lady, uh, grandmotherly type, uh, who's wearing a, uh, a mask because she's not She's not well, no one's bothering her. If you see a, a woman uh, who's walking in a burqa, let's say, no one's bothering her, no one cares. 